Hey guys, it's Adam E.K. Swimming Bird, and you're in my face. Welcome to Splatoon. This is Splatter Day Night Live, and we are about to jump online to play some Turf Wars and Rainmaker. And I also want another shot at using the Hydra Splatling, the new weapon that just came out this week. The second new weapon. But first off, I wanted to show you, this is, I don't know, what do you guys think? Rate my squid. I'm thinking, uh, <laughs> this might be the gear I go with. I'll show you guys. I really like this rugby shirt. I've, uh, I've had my eye on this thing since the game came out. It's a striped rugby shirt. It looks nice. It, it kind of reminds me of Earthbound. It looks a little bit like Lucas from Mother 3. But this is the new Squid Nordic, and then these boots. I've, I've kind of gravitated towards them for a bit because they have Bomb Sniffer on them. So I'm thinking about using this stuff, but for now, before I level it up, I'm going to switch to my Old Faithfuls here. I was looking at this shirt as well. This is kind of cool. Got a target on it so people will shoot you. Okay, but yeah, let's grab this stuff and get into it. I'm just going to try to warm up with the Splatter Shot. I barely used the Junior, so I think this is a good, you know, a good time to start out, and I'll take your suggestions in the chat as typical for, you know, these streams. I'm gonna very quickly, though, look at the show. Ooh, look at these. Somebody has two years of jazz and tap in behind their belt, <laughs> all right. And what else do we got? Baseball and basketball here, okay. And, ooh, oh, I kinda want these. Quick respawn, not too bad. I do like the noise cancelers. They look a little nicer than the headphones I have on, the studio ones. So let me buy those. I'm not gonna use them tonight, but I am thinking about it, all right. So anyways, thank you guys again. 20 out of 20, 10 out of 10. Thank you, Ice Dog, Cyclone. Lots of good. You're looking fresh, this kill man. You guys are just flattering me. Okay, let's, uh, oop, we already have that. Don't yell at me, Mo. Wasting our time. We're gonna jump in, and I think starting with Turf Wars would be a good way to warm, warm up. Gotta get my, uh, my ink and finger ready to go. Let's do it. So we got Urchin Underpass and Hammerhead Bridge. Tonight's ranked rotation is Rainmaker. Oop. And a communications error right off the bat. We have Rainmaker with Camp Triggerfish and Museum Del Foncino. Two of my favorite maps. I do really like the new map a lot. I just gotta get better at it, I think. And Rainmaker is kind of a do or die situation there. Oh man, so this very rarely happens, but at least I can have a heart to heart with you guys in the chat. It'll put you into the queue sometimes and you can see there's a timer of how long we gotta wait until the next match. It's a little unfortunate, but sometimes that's the way things go. But yeah, I very rarely have this happen. Usually it just starts a new queue for you, but I guess some people might have dropped out of this match that we're going to be jumping into here in a second. It is kind of... Uh, some other, you know, shooter games throw you right into a match. Like TF2 is a good example. They'll throw you in a match while it's going on and you can jump in, but a lot of the time you'll be like auto put on a team and then it loses automatically, which would be very sad in Splatoon, especially if it's a ranked match, you would lose points. And it would be very, uh, very bad for the morale of the squid kids out there. So I'm, I'm kind of glad they don't do that at the same time, even though we got to wait a minute here. Notice me, Senpai, says Hayden. I see you there. <laughs> Hi, I'm new. This is Venate. Nice to have you in the stream. We've been uh, streaming Splatoon. I think this is four days in a row now. I've been, I don't know, I've just been reinvigorated to play again. And I want to try to keep up, you know, keep the streams going so that we have a lot of chances to let you guys jump in as well, because I'm, I'm freeing up spots on the uh, the Squid Squad, the Bloop Troop, every night that we do this. So, you know, the, the drill, if you don't know by now, if you want to join and play Splatoon, if you've got a Wii U, or you're thinking about getting one, we, pretty much every stream or every episode that I play, I play with anyone I've already added to my friends list, which is 100 slots, and after that, I will delete anyone I get to play with, which is, you know, kind of a necessary thing to let new people on. And then I pull the new people from the 100 friend requests I have going right now, and that opens up request spots. So you can add Nintendo Network ID, Swimmy Bird, and just mention Splatoon in your request, and then I will put you in the queue. And it might take a while, but I'm trying to get to everyone I can. I know some people have been waiting for a few weeks now to jump on, and I've got some more spots opening up tonight, hopefully. So we'll do that, but I wanted to, you know, give the rundown a little earlier in the stream. Usually I mention this at the end, if you do want to join. Lots of notice me's now that I, uh, I mentioned a few of you. I see you guys. Thank you for joining in. I do appreciate having you guys to play with and to hang out with even. Just to, you know, hang out in the chat it is nice. Good company. You guys are good company. All right. <laughs> I've been noticed since Cyclone Club. Okay. So yeah, this is, uh... 
There we go. They're on the results. We're jumping in. Sorry for the delay, but unless I completely turned the game off, there's no way to, to get out of that once you lock into a lobby, unfortunately. But I think they don't they won't want people dropping out and messing up the, the matches. But still, it, it does happen sometimes. You've noticed occasionally we get matches where we lose friends and uh, make enemies. No, <laughs> but people will drop out, and you got to worry about that. Okay, first match of the night. We are... About 30 points away, a couple wins from leveling up, which is nice. And then uh, we can, we'll can we switch up weapons after this. I just figured I don't use the Splattershot Jr. that much. This would be a great opportunity for me to, uh, to use it here. So we're going to do that. Let's go. Hopefully I got a good team. And we're going up. Oh, we got a Dynamo. I always have a rough time. This is Turf Wars, so I think the Splattershot Jr. is going to be a better better weapon to, to use here. Let's kind of... You know, blitz in because I think it's important to get the uh, get the middle turf here. Don't want to worry too much about the sides. I do miss how crazy the coverage is on the old Splattershot Junior. Look at this. I've already almost built up my special all the way, and now I got it. All right, let me throw one of these down there. And maybe another over there. <laughs> Trying to you know fan out here. Got to look out for that. I'm gonna help my buddy with the bubbler. Oh, where did they go? They're escaping while I'm bubbling. Jumping out of here. Get him, get him, get him. Nope. They're going to get me. <laughs> I tried to jump through the rail, but I got stuck in Ink Zuka. It's okay. I thought I got my buddy. I was like, I see somebody right there. Let me bubble. And at least someone else. I feel bad if, if no one else gets the effect of the bubbler. Because it's a little like a waste since you can share it with your teammates. But at times, uh, can't really do too much. I just saw someone over there. So I'm going to kind of sneak this way. Look out. Keep my buddy's feet inked. If you stand in enemy ink, you do take damage. Unless you have... Well, you do still, even if you have ink resistance. But it definitely helps to have ink resistance. Like, I'm on my shoes here. So it is nice to uh, to help your friends out if they get inked, you know, under them. You can kind of shoot at their feet. I'm trying to make sure I don't get snuck up on. But at the same time, I'm also looking out because I don't want... Oh, jeez. Yeah, they waited for me. And then dynamoed wasn't the best idea to go out there. The blue team not doing so hot. Well, except this little guy in enemy territory. I'm going to try to jump to him and see how we do here. Put one of those in. Yeah, I might be able to actually use this to our advantage to kind of invade their turf and mess with their their area here. Ooh, get him, get him, get him. Where did they go? I lost them. Where are they? Oh, they're gone. They jumped over that way. There we go. And I can bubble. To stop this one. There we are. <laughs> I got really confused there for a little bit, but we're okay. They're going to be respawning and following me any second here, so I need to really get up this and through and watch behind me, spinning around all over the place. Here they come. Yeah, I think we might be able to bring this back because we did go into the, uh, the enemy territory. I don't even know if he knew I was... I think they were tracking us, I was going to say. I don't even know if he knew that <laughs> I was coming through there, but he did that anyways and just happened to get me. All right, let's throw one of those through. Get this little kid. Oh, man, the arrow spray I think might be a bit more powerful than the Splattershot Jr., as fun as the Splattershot Jr. is to use. I'm going to jump to my buddy. There's, like, no time and a lot of turf to ink, but try my best here to get some of this in the end. Uh, it's kind of mixed, but I think there's more blue here. What do you guys think? All right. Oh, man, that was closer than I thought it would be. All right. Well, that was a good warm-up. I think it's ready to, you know, I'm ready to go back into ranked mode and switch to some more powerful weaponry. We're on the top of the team, so I don't feel too bad. Their dynamo guy was doing crazy, though. Lots of turf and lots of splats. All right. So, yeah, the, uh, the gear I'm using here, I switched to this again because... If we are going to jump in ranked mode, I don't like to be leveling up gear and not having all the abilities I could have. So I switched off of the, you know, the new the stuff that I'm thinking about leveling. But at the same time, I uh, I want to have these these nice abilities here. Like Ink uh, Ink Saber Main is one of my favorites. It's that little one that looks like a tent attack because that really helps you conserve ink when you're firing, which is very important for weapons that very you know, swiftly empty your ink tank. Like the Hydra Splatling here, the new weapon that just came out in the uh, last, last couple days here, will just completely drain 
your your ink tank with only a few charges. I think it takes like a third of a tank. It's crazy. And uh, even with ink savers, it seems like it is tough to use. Let's see if we can get a squad going. And I'll keep an eye on the chat as well. 96 gal, says SquidKid47. We can do the 96 gal soon. It's weird, the, the 52 gal and the 96 gal. 96 is supposed to be stronger. It has better range. But the 52 gal, I almost feel like, is just better at, you know, it only takes like two to three, I think, maybe three three shots to splat an enemy in clean, while the 96 is like two. So there's like a very small range in there of how much damage you need to do, and the 96 is slower, so it's like, might as well go with the, the 52, I don't know. Uh, Raisin Bray, or Bree, says, uh, I like those new headphones. Yeah, me too. I think they're the cooler looking of the, uh, the headphone bunch. We do have like the ones that wrap around, I think. Or no, they, they go over over the head, but they have like a sleeker design. But I think the noise cancelers are nice looking. We got Grunky and Clyde. Grunky, I think, returning. If a while back, he was on the bloop troop, but he made his way back on again. Nice to have you, buddy. I'm an Octolene, says Pretty K. <laughs> oh, I, no one else, unless you're, unless you're hacking, no one's officially an Octolene yet. But here's hoping we're going to get that update sometime. All right, thank you guys again. I just, uh, we're, we're streaming Splatoon now, but I streamed a little earlier, if you didn't see, we played Animal Crossing Happy Home Designer. Ooh, David's an S rank. That's gonna have some S squads against us, though, unfortunately, most likely. But yeah, the, uh, Happy Home Designer we just streamed, because I wanted to mix it up a little bit, do something fresh before we went back into Splatoon. But I had a lot of fun. I, I hope a lot of you got to be in that stream as well and hang out. We built a bathroom-themed restaurant, <laughs> which does not sound good, but I, I'm pretty proud of it. It turned out really well, and uh, <laughs> so yeah, hopefully you guys, if you you know, you want to watch the video version, that'll go up to to watch if you're interested in Animal Crossing. T the the main developers of Splatoon, there was like ten different people, were all from Animal Crossing development, so there's a lot of crossover between those games. Believe it or not, even though one is so peaceful and one is so you know so aggressive and and violent, but, you know, in a good way. It's fun. Uh, <laughs> also, I was just thinking, we I built that weird bathroom-themed cafe, but Splatoon, one of the things in the art book recently, they, they released that art book in Japan, and one of the ideas that they scrapped from the game was urinals that you would travel through, like portals, you would jump in it, kind of like we do with the... Uh, I think we jump in the tea kettles to travel around now in, in single-player and stuff, or use the little zip lines and stuff, ink lines. But yeah, the... The urinal idea got scrapped, I think, maybe to keep it ETH for everyone and not too odd. There's a weird ranking on that team there, speaking of ETH for everyone. Uh, but yeah, they, they scrapped that idea, but it seemed kind of funny to, to do. I don't know if it'll ever find its way back in. There were pictures in the art book, though, of the... It was like a, a mine, like a coal mine type map, and I think that's going to be the quarry, which is one of the last two maps that have yet to be uh, released here. All right, this is Rainmaker. We are fighting an almost completely S-ranked team. So we're gonna have to do our best to uh, keep up with them and hopefully we can do it. Try to get my ink levels up enough and charge up to uh, stop these guys. There's one over there, going through. Almost got him. Oh, yeah, there we go. Just barely survived that. Okay, let's see if we can push in these S-rankers. Not gonna go easy on us, that's for sure. And right, let's charge this up and look out, because there's a guy right there. And over there, they took that already. Oh, the one was gonna crack in, but it, he didn't get to crack in in time. Oh, that guy's gonna go around that way. Just saw them I'm trying to slow him down here. I have to stay far enough away where I won't get, you know, destroyed by these guys. But I'm gonna do my best to uh, try to not get too close in here. Oh geez, there we go. Got one with the with the uh, slap bomb. There's a kid going on my, on our way here. Can I stop him? Yeah, I got to be careful not to fully charge this unless I am ready to uh, unleash the power of the Hydra. Almost got the one. Nope. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him. Ah! <laughs> there goes my giant weapon falling into the depths. Nobody's really pushing the Rainmaker that far, though. We're kind of doing a good job of holding him back. Get a little bit more ink here. But yeah, the Hydra, I do actually like it way more than I thought I would. I don't know. For whatever reason, it's grown on me. And uh, I didn't think it was going to be a weapon that I would do great with, but it, uh, it ended up being one that I like a lot. 
Almost got the one. Oh, jeez. Get out of there. What is that art on the wall? That's not a Miiverse post. That's actually supposed to be a piece of art at this museum. Bizarre. <laughs> Doesn't really look like uh, look art there. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I'm getting through. I gotta get up here. Stop them. Gotta stop them. I can. Oh, they're going over there. Are they just stalling? They don't really have a lead, though, so it wouldn't make sense for them to stall. I think we're pretty even in this. How do I even get up on some of these spots? I don't know if you can. Someone's going to be going this way if I'm not careful. Okay, here they come. Where are they? Where are they? There's one right there. Get that one. Get that one. Ah, oh, I almost had the Rainmaker, but the other ones jumped in in time. I was like, I'm going to get like two or three of these. But it was for naught. Right, let me see if I can get some more ink with my... I'm trying to throw the Splat Bomb right off the bat, because I know by the time I get back, I'll have my ink built up enough to... Uh, yeah, here we go. They're coming around that way. Coming around the mountain. When she comes. Oh, jeez. <laughs> see if I can stop these guys here. Got the one. Here comes another. can track them. I see them. I see them. Coming through. Oh, man, these walls. The walls are cool, but they get in the way a lot of the time. Noticed. All right, we got to slow these guys down. There we go. Okay, we're... Ooh. We need to be in there. We need to be in there. He's going to get him. Yeah, they took it. This is rough to uh, get used to uh, get used to charging so much. Getting back into it, though. We're uh, we're getting a little better at some of these other weapons. I've noticed playing four nights in a row definitely keeps your skills up, because they've got a lead here, but I don't think we're going to get knocked out necessarily. There we go. I saw you up there. See if I can stop this little guy here in time. Someone coming through there. He's going up that side. Recharge my ink, please. And where's the other ones going? Just saw someone over there. Oh, no. One of those down. Maybe I'll get him. <laughs> they lost it. Yeah, this is going to be rough, unless we're quick. I don't know if we can get enough points here to do this. Go, 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 go. Okay, everyone's pushing. Everyone's pushing. We're all in this together. Stop, stop, stop them. Here comes one right there. Oh, get him, get him. Ah, jeez. <laughs> I had my, my charge enough. Yeah, this is so close. We're fighting an S-rank squad, and the bloop troop is holding their own. That's awesome. I love to see this. I think it's because maybe I'm also pulling my weight a little more than I usually do. Let's see if I can get the Rainmaker. Or one of them. I know there's more of them over here. I just saw them. Stop them in their tracks. Here they go. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta push this in, or we're gonna be in trouble. I can stop this little guy. There we are. Yeah, I love the Hydra because if you charge it up a lot, you can still get someone even if you're, you know, running out of time to, to hit them. Oh, where did they go? They're all over the place. I don't know if I can do this. <laughs> Maybe a little bit more and... Ah, ran out of time. Yeah, I think they got us. That was a good back and forth. That was a really nice clash. And they did beat us by a good amount of points because they pushed it right at the end. But I felt like we could have brought it back. Thank you, Clyde Grunky and David, right? Yeah, David. All did very well, especially considering how many S-rankers we were up against. I got more splats than the top of their team. So I'm happy about that with my Hydra. All right. Let's do another one here. Help Malcolm says, notice the chat. I see you, buddy. I try to keep an eye on it when I'm playing, but sometimes it can be a little tough. I will definitely look at it in between matches, though. All right, Hydra's Bay says Draconic Warrior of Awesomeness. I think it might be. It's weird. I I do like the Splatlings, but I was fully expecting the the spl the Hydra Splatling to be kind of like uh, the E Leader, where I feel like it's almost just too slow for me to really get a handle of it or feel like I could react quick enough. But for whatever reason, this this one's just gelling with me more than the uh, the rest of the Splatlings. I like the heavy Splatling as well. But, uh, ooh, look at this. Let's switch off for it for a match, though. I kind of want to use my Octo Brush because I don't get to use that in ranked mode, typically. <laughs> and this is, uh, this is a good mode here. Let me switch my, switch my hat to Samurai mode since we are going with the Octo Brush. All right. But, yeah, this is, this is a ranked mode that I feel like I can actually use the Octo Brush and still compete, unlike Tower Control, which the brushes, they can't really reach the tower that well. Uh, I just saw Angie said, use your Octobrush. I'm doing it, Angie. I read your mind, and you read mine. All right, Carbon Roller, lots of good suggestions here. 
and Zap. We can do those. We'll just do it after this match, though. We got more S-Rankers. Mooney, another S-Ranker here. Adding into the uh, the troop. I noticed more and more you guys are you guys are all S getting to S rank and helping out the Squid Squad a lot, so I appreciate all the training that you, you guys do in the meantime. Okay, a tri squad, two S rankers, one B plus. I think we can do it. We'll see. Alright. Who's playing Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival while watching, says Natalie. I uh I, I I'm kinda mixed on that game. If you guys watched, I did a few episodes with Danielle and we're gonna do some more. For sure, but that—that's actually I noticed that's like the lowest, I, not the lowest, the lowest rated uh, Nintendo title I think for a while, if not uh, of all time. It's—it's it's a little sad. I think it's a fun, nice little like deviation that can be relaxing, but at the same time, it's a—it's uh, not the most exciting game. So I can kind of see why people uh, people might not be as into it. Ah, I couldn't tell which side they were shooting from. I should have not tried to climb that. All right, gotta focus. But yeah, I've I've enjoyed it for what it is. But it's weird. It's like you probably would be better off playing Mario Party if you want to play a game like that, because you get the excitement of the, the mini games in Mario Party at least. Yeah, let me see if I can get in here in time to actually stop these guys. Get them, get them, get them. There we go, got one of them. You know, someone else is gonna be around here looking for me any second now. All right, let me try to lead a lead a path for them to go through. Oh, jeez. Go, 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 Rainmaker. Get this one, and Kraken! Oh, I pushed it just the wrong time. I was trying to lead a little bit of a path for the Rainmaker, but I should have used my... The Kraken's really good at making a nice path, though. I noticed. All right, let me go up this way. Try to keep this inked and get my Kraken going again. Because, yeah, I should have I should have popped the Kraken, but I ran out of time. Just, they took me down before I could do it. Oh, we lost it. Where did it go? Oh, I thought it was over here. Didn't I just see the Rainmaker swim over this way? That was weird. Stop someone here. All right, Kraken time. Kraken time. Oh, can I get one of them? Can I get two of them? Get it, get it. Ah, <laughs> so that's, again, another way the craft, the, the craft. The Kraken was uh, was nerfed, just like the rollers. A bunch of the a bunch of the weapons and stuff were nerfed, but the Kraken it takes a split second or a, almost a split second, I think, before you can fire again after you uh, run out of Kraken. Once you re you know turn back into a Squid Kid, you will have to wait a little bit. Just saw someone over here. I thought, where are they? They're coming over, and. Can we get up here and stop him? Oh, got the one at least. But yeah, it takes a split second after you return into a squid kid from the Kraken before you can fire your weapon. So it's a little sad because if you don't get someone with the Kraken, they'll pretty much get you right when you turn back, as you guys saw. All right, let's see if we can jump in here as soon as somebody gets close enough. I'm going to jump in and uh, try to take him down. There we go. The one. Got the other, maybe. It's probably a good time to, uh... Nope. Not that. There we go. <laughs> Took one down, at least. I was gonna say, that would be a good place to put a beacon, but I don't know. People would people would find it pretty quick. Alright, let me see if I can jump in before everyone gets back here. We're doing okay. We got a little bit of distance on them. Oh, yeah, this is the Tri-Squad, so... They're probably not, you know, the toughest of the bunch here. But, ooh. Can I stop this? And get whoever's close. There we go, got one of them. And it's cracking time. They're using a bomb rush. Jump in. There we are. <laughs> and yeah, it takes a little bit for sure after you're transformed again to return to firing. Alright, let me see if I can. I can't see anything with these. Ah! <laughs> can't see anything with those little things spinning in my face. Yeah, that's that's one, I guess, uh, a negative about having, having the. Uh, the little spinner spinners going everywhere. They're gonna get me, aren't they? Oh, <laughs> I almost grabbed it. I like landed right into the shield. Oh, I did get squished by the shield because it pushed me into a wall. That doesn't happen that often. But yeah, the the bad thing about these little spinning art exhibits is that they can block your view or get in your way. And you don't want them to. All right, let me see if I can jump up here and get this little guy. Oh, I get it. I got him. <laughs> I get him. I got him. They're good. They might push it in right at the end, though, if we don't stop them. We kind of all got splatted there at one point. 
We're doing okay. I think we'll be fine. Just gotta make sure they don't get through. Where are they? Okay, it's on top of the thing. It's on top of it, and it's spinning around. Can I get the, uh... Yeah, it's in a weird spot where I might be able to grab it, though. Oh, jeez. Okay, I took it! I need help here, though. Or we're gonna be in trouble. Get that kid out of here. Get him, get him, get him. Don't want to go too fast, because I jumped right into someone, I think. Oh, it was a suction bomb that I didn't see. Okay, guys, we got the advantage. We can just hold on to it. We should be good. I'm gonna try to jump in last few seconds here. Do not let them get it, or we'll be in trouble. Stop that squid. Stop that kid. All right, as long as we stop them here, we should be okay. Oh, no, 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 no. They're going around that way. Stop this kid. At least, hopefully. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, ah, uh, almost got the one. Oh no, this is bad. This is, uh, this is pretty bad. If they manage to break through. My whole team's over there, though. The blue troopers fighting, fighting the good fight. All right, good job. <laughs> Someone stopped them. No knockout, but we did well. Good job, team. All right, Turf War is stinky, says Mike. I don't know if that was an ink pun. Stinky was what I wanted to name the Bloop Troop mascot, but Blooper was by far more popular with you guys, so that's what we went with. Oh man, I got 10 splats. Not too bad. Don't usually get into the double digits. All right. You need Bomb Sniffer, says Ariana. Yeah, uh, I think that would be good to get on the... Uh, I do like those trail boots as well. They look good. So I think that's one of the things I want to prioritize. I don't know how well Ink Resistance is helping me. Sorry, Mooney. I gotta jump, jump out here, try to see if we got anyone else to join, give everybody a shot. Uh, but yeah, Bomb Sniffer, it shows you a little skull and crossbones whenever someone throws a bomb, so I probably wouldn't have gotten splatted by that suction bomb if I knew it was there. But yeah, that's definitely an uh, ability that I'm looking forward to trying out here soon, because I've seen other people use it to good effect. Okay, so what, what did I see in the chat earlier? I'm trying to remember your suggestions. I did see uh, the end zap. Let's try the end zap 89. And then I can't remember, what was the, the 85 has, yeah, that's the same loadout as the Hydra actually. But I'll do the 89 because it's got that sprinkler, the inkler, and the, uh, I like the ink strike as well for this mode. If you can see where people are going, then you can stop them. Uh, rank, what rank mode are you the most excited to use the Hydra on, said Sarah. I think it works pretty well on Rainmaker because the Rainmaker is so, you know, marked and obvious that you can you can stay back and, and slow them down. It's a very good defensive tool to keep the Rainmaker at bay. Splat zones, I think, would be great as well for the Hydra, but tower control, we did okay. I think the Hydra will work on most of the ranked modes, and also did okay on Turf Wars, so I don't think it's bad on any of them. Uh, unlike the brushes, which I love the brushes, but I, for tower control, I can never seem to get the brush to work very well. I think it's because if I'm on the ground and someone's on the tower, can't reach them. I think this is also the same tri-squad that we just fought. We're going to Triggerfish. All right, good. This is where I wanted to head, mix it up, keep it fresh. All right, let's see how we do. What did I, oh yeah. Oh, they've got all the hero weapons. They have like the hero shot and the uh, and the hero charger there. I don't wanna throw that there. Okay, good, good, good. But yeah, they've, they're using the like hero weapons. Gotta be careful here, cause they're all gonna, they're all gonna sneak around and try to get us sneaky spots. I don't think I can shoot all the way over there, despite this thing having pretty decent range. Alright, they're going that way. I'm gonna try to, you know, throw those sprinklers down to distract them and lead the way for my little... Oh, nice! Nice job! Lead the way for my buddy here. Throw this down up there. Get a little bit of ink going. Charge back up. Jeez. Oh, they sniped us! They sniped us good. Can I stop them? They're right there. Oh! Get them! Get them! They're right here as well! <laughs> no! I was like, the sniper is hiding over there. Maybe I can ink strike, but got a little too distracted from the, the task at hand, and now I'm in trouble. Alright, they're coming in. They're going both ways, most likely. Ah! <laughs> they got me! Get them! <laughs> uh, they managed to super jump in and still get them. This is uh, not good. We had a good lead. Now we're not doing as well. Okay, I'm gonna try to get in there. I like just kind of throwing the sprinkler in a good spot so that I can build up my special while we're going through. Okay, there's these little kids. Stop them, stop them, stop them. All right, one's going up there. Ah, uh, <laughs> didn't think they'd hit me on the side. 
But they got me. They got me. I'll give them that. Alright. It looks so cool to hold the Rainmaker. I don't know why. It's just this death machine. But it's also... I like the design of it a lot. It's got that, like, traditional design, but it has a very modern sense of killing. No! I didn't think they would be able to hit me from that far back. I was, like, behind it, but I think there was the lag of uh, me being there, and they shot me when I was there, and then it looked like they hit me when I wasn't. All right, we're good, we're good. Let's go. Should I take it? I guess so. Oh, I'm just gonna go. I'm just going. I'm just jumping through, and hopefully someone else will get them. And I'll try to, uh, yeah, go, go, go with that splatling. And guard it. Okay, good, you got, good job. I gotta get through there quick, though. If I can do this. Get him with the splatling! Go, go, go! And then, dunk it! Dunk it! <laughs> yeah, alright. Thank you, team. You guys made me look pretty good there. <laughs> alright. Let's uh, do this real quick while I'm checking out. The, uh, the chat here, alright. <laughs> Make sure I'm looking at the, at the weapon suggestions as well. That was a good match, though. I feel like I wasn't pulling my weight as much, but then it worked out in the end. We ended up winning, and I even got to slam dunk it, which I don't get to do that often, so that, that's a great feeling to be able to do that. <laughs> alright. Thank you guys again for tuning in. What do we use next? What do we want to do? I saw the carbon roller earlier um but yeah i think maybe we should let me drop out here i want to give some other people a chance to jump in as well but yeah let's do a new squad and then i need to switch off my helmet for sure the damage up on the samurai helmet helps for certain weapons but i don't think it's really worth it with other ones so i'd rather have that ink saver main let's do carbon roller how about the this it's probably not a bad map to use the seekers we'll do the seeker bomb rush the crowd favorite. <laughs> Alright, Carbon Roller. Just did the end zap. Someone suggested it, but we just switched off of it. The Mini Splatling, I think we gotta try that a little more. Because I feel like I never gave that a fair shake. I love the Hydra now. And, uh, I don't need to, you know, need to worry about having to go back to the other Splatlings. If I do, you know, really love using the Hydra, I think it's good. But the other ones have their appeal as well. They're much faster to charge. They're still very strong as well. And uh, hopefully, I can kind of get the hang of them. It's weird that the one that I think would be the hardest, the, the Hydra, is the one that I like the most and seem to grok with the best. Alright, so let's see. We got S rank in here again, David, but a C plus. Kevin, okay, let's see how Kevin does with the, uh, the Octobrush against an entire plus ranked <laughs> team. Okay, this is more our level, though. I know we got an S rank in here, but I like to see A rank teams instead of all S. Because I think it makes it a little nicer to switch things up, not use the main weapons so much, and feel like we we you know we have to use the best weapons that we we do the best with. We can still win with uh with other ones as long as the team isn't like crazy good. <laughs> All right, I do love how fast the carbon roller is to flick though. Let me see if I can get some seekers going in here. Kind of try to lay the path a little bit. There's someone going that way. Oh, there they are. Oh, that got blown up really fast. They're gonna hit me if I'm not careful. They know I have Seekers, so they're trying to hit me when I'm, whoop, hit, hit at me when I'm, uh, you know, not able to aim at them. All right, go, go, go. <laughs> this is the time. No! <laughs> go, 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 no, no, no. The Seekers, I was like trying my best to aim at them, but you notice there's so many like stairs and different spots. I wonder if they are really that great on this map. I think they're pretty good on Camp Triggerfish, though. Let's build up my bomb rush. People having the, uh, jeez. People having the echolocator is definitely helpful to use these, though. There's someone shooting over there. There we go. I got someone with a seeker. Throw that down. Don't hit the spinner. <laughs> That's another thing, too. You could send one of these out, and then the, uh, spinner will get you. Man, outrange. Ni 50, or 96, I was gonna say. The range on that was really good. But yeah, the, the, the spinning parts are just there to block your seekers, it seems like. Yeah, maybe not the best on this map. I'll try using them. Get them, get them! Ah, oh, jeez! There we go. That was close. I think I had a little help. Ah, uh, <laughs> Is the 96... Oh, no, the Forge. They are giving me a run for my money. They got the, the jersey that I like, the jockey. 
or not jockey, rugby. <laughs> jockey and rugby stuff kind of do look similar at times. I want to get someone with a seeker here. They're far enough away. Yeah, I'm tr I'm focusing too much on my seekers. I think I don't need to be using those every every time. If I can use the carbon roller and do better with them. There's someone right there. There we go. Keep this inked. We need this on our side. Throw a bunch of these all out. Maybe maybe one of them will hit someone. <laughs> and look out. Yeah, none of them got anyone, but that's okay. Scared them off of going onto the ground, right? Okay, someone's over there. Definitely get them. Oh, there we go. Got someone. That's good. Go, 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 go. Someone's took the Rainmaker. This is my time to jump up here and get them. No. Go, go, go. <laughs> oh, oh, hit it. <laughs> I got my bomb rush, but I don't know how well it's going to work on this. Look out. Ooh, oh, no, 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 no. Got to help my buddies out, but I'm not going to be able to do it. <laughs> yeah, the Seekers, I'm like trying to use those for long range, but on this map, not working out so much. I didn't want to waste my bomb rush, but it did not prove that useful when I just got splatted anyways. Let's see if that'll take him out. Nope. Well, someone's over here, though. If I can st Oh my gosh! I got him, but the splash splash wall got me. That doesn't happen that often. I think I need to get a, yeah, another better ranged weapon, or at least the, the carbon roller with the burst bombs is probably a better bet. Seekers, so good on certain maps. Not so great on others. Okay, let's get this going. I need to focus more on helping with the Rainmaker or we're going to be in trouble here. Oh, I thought I grabbed it, but I didn't. Okay, bomb rush time. Bomb rush, bomb rush. Stop everyone in their tracks, hopefully. Here we go. Slow them down at least a little bit. Just someone up there. Stop them, stop them, stop them. There goes someone around that way. Ugh, jeez. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him. Oh my gosh. Yeah, having a rough time stopping anyone. The Rainmaker is right here. Oh, no, 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 no. As soon as they jump through, I'll slow them down. Oh. Yeah, they're, they're not going to take the bottom way, most likely, though. Oh, can we can we stop this? Nope, nope, no, no. Back away. I don't think it's going to happen. Or is it? <laughs> you don't want to be next to the Rainmaker shield at the same time. Ugh. Oh. Jeez. <laughs> oh, they got the Rainmaker over there. Stop him, stop him, stop him, stop him. Everybody. <laughs> okay, one of those guys has to hit him, right? Jeez, having such a tough time using the Seekers. <laughs> yeah, the Seekers are more just being a distraction for me that's not helping out rather than being something that's actually helping me, so I should, I should use something else. Or just not focus on him. Oh, we really have to get it. Gotta get it through here. Can I stop him in time? Oh, jeez. No, no, no. Ah, uh, slowed him down. Can they get in there? I don't know. Push it, push it. They're kind of holding on to it and hesitating, but I don't know if it's gonna work because as soon as they get splatted, they're in trouble. Yep, we lost. Oh, well. I think we need to switch weapon. <laughs> I do like the carbon roller. It's just the range is not as good as I want, I think, and the Seeker's not so great on the museum. All right, Any, what, are, what are some suggestions you guys got? We'll, we'll mix it up in the weapon department. I still got a few splats, just not pulling my weight too well there, I think. We're almost in A rank, though. Uh, let's see. What do we got here? Uh, Splattershot Pro, Splushomatic. Regular ranked mode. Yeah, we're, we're just playing in, in normal ranked, but squad, so we get to get to play together. You can't join your friends in ranked mode normally, but you can join them in Turf Wars, so I think that's why they created squads, to kind of make a way to do that. Originally, I think they, they thought it would be too tough for people if they were coordinating so much, but they made a way for it. All right, Tent Attack. I can do that. I think that would get us a win. So I'm going to switch to the Tent Attack. And then we'll switch off 96 gal, that would be good. I love having the Kraken. And then maybe more Hydra and a little bit, or the Brush, tri -slosher. A couple tri -sloshers. The tri is weird where I don't know if it, uh... Yeah, it's... it's I haven't seen the, the new one that's coming out, the Sloshing Machine. We haven't tried that out yet. But the tri is my least favorite of the, the Slosher ones. Just because it's a very wide 
weapon but not very long so again you have to be super close and in a lot of these modes it's hard to get close <laughs> especially if they have charger weapons keeping you at bay all right can you use a charger says uh bio bruce i do feel like uh the chargers are a little tougher for me to use but we can try them out the slot the splatlings are kind of like chargers but i think they have a little bit more of the uh the rapid fire that i i like to cover my bad aim okay Good suggestions in the chat. Lots of brushes, splatter scope. We'll get onto one of the, the other ones here in a sec. But for now, we're using the Tentatech. I think we got a good, good map, you know, blending of uh, types. But we are weapons. I mean, oh, is that a bloop, tr bloop troop Froyo? No, I don't think that's part of the bloop troop, right? That would be really weird to match up with someone who is supposed to be on the squad <laughs> against us. A two Froyo. He's turned on us. No, there might be another squad that's BT Infinity or something. Oh, jeez. Aim my thing. There we go. All right, we're going back to the museum. We got a season pass here, and we're going to see all there is. The little statues, all the good stuff. Throw that in. Just if I can jump up and uh, stop that kid. There we go. They definitely have a, uh, a nice sniper going through. Stop this one. Oh, jeez. No, no, no. I'm in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if I can slow him down. No! My my Inkzuka. Slightly off, and then it's a waste. But it's okay. We got it in our turf. We can, we can get this back. Possibly. We'll see. Go, 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 go. Stop them in their tracks. Gotta look out, because they can easily snipe us. Yeah, that's... That heavy splatling still has a crazy good range. Alright, let me see if I can kind of protect back here. Nope! Oh no! I got him. But I used my Inkzuka again at the wrong time. Keep trying to get that nice Inkzuka coverage. Oh, get that! There, there's a... a whatchamacallit? <laughs> I don't think anyone sees it, but there's a squid beacon over there. And it's gonna prove fatal if we're not careful. Someone's gonna jump right to it. Get him, get him. Oh, there we go. Got one of them. Let's see if I can slow down these guys here. All right, I'm going to do this. Get that one. There we go. Blow that up as well. <laughs> Inkzuka helped me out. Just saw someone down here. There they are. Because of that beacon. Got him with the beacon. No, I got sniped. The E-Leader, it's crazy. It's like halfway across the map. But that's how she goes. I can't, I always am like shocked by how far the E-Leader can shoot, and then you don't even need to really charge it all the way, it's still so effective. Throw those in, shoot them down, slow them down a little bit at least, oh no, this is bad, bad news, I can get him, get him, get him, get him, oh, almost, oh jeez, oh, someone's gonna be over here, but I'm not careful, there we go, got two of them in a row. They almost got it, though. All right, I'm going to try my best to get back over here and clear the way and not get sniped. If I can. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow him down. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm getting lots of splats, but I'm not clearing the way as much as I should for these guys. All right. Yeah, they keep using their beacons. we got to look out for those. Right, that's going to get us in the end here. Stop them, stop them. I gotta get in there. Can't stay back here. Can't be too scared to jump into the fray, or we're gonna be in trouble. There we go. Almost got my Inkzuka. This would be great to uh, help us get through. Okay, go, go, go. Oh, jeez. Okay, Inkzuka time. Oh, there we go. Got one of their snipers. And I'm falling down, but I'm trying my best here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, there's someone right there. Nope. Oh. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Throw that down. I know they're going around. Did the one guy get splatted? He did. Get this kid. Get this squid. Oh. <laughs> Alright, we're bringing it back. We just really got to push. I don't know if we're going to be able to. We're so close, though. Go, go, go. Yeah, they took it. Man, this is a back and forth. And they've got the lead on us, for sure. Oh, no. Kraken. Kraken. Stay away. A little Kraken. There we go. Slowed him down enough to uh, take him out there. See if we can get them 
Uh, Inkzuka! Inkzuka, my savior! Inkzuka! <laughs> There we go. Take it out. Go, go, go. They're taking it into a weird spot, so it's going to be very tough for us to uh, to finish them here. We don't have the time. They put it into a weird position, and they have a ton of beacons. That's what, what we're not doing. We need to use those beacons, because as soon as they die, they can respawn over at the beacons and take us out really easily. Don't just hide there. Get them. This guy. Go, 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 go. Oh, that's their sniper. Uh, help me! I'm running out of ink! Oh my gosh. They're gonna sneak around and just take us out that way, aren't they? Oh. See someone going through. There they are. Get them, get them, get them. Oh my gosh. We gotta take this. Take it to the hoop. Go, go, go. I'll cover with the ink suka. Get him in. Get him to the. <laughs> get him to the Greek. Go, 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 go. Yeah, we have no time unless this gets blasted. We're done. That was a good, good defense, though. <laughs> Started spouting Russell Brandt movie titles at the end. Okay. Well, we didn't get knocked out, and I do appreciate that. Good fight, everyone. <laughs> I felt like I never was like on top of what was happening a lot of the time. I got a good amount of splats, though. I'm proud of that. Same as the level 50 on the enemy team. Okay, so what are we using? What kind of channel is this, <laughs> Cynthia? It's a gaming channel. We leveled up. All right. I haven't played Splatoon so long, says so Sarah. This is a good time to get back into it. I keep, uh, you know, every once in a while between content updates, I'll slow down playing. But I think it's, you know, anytime's good to jump in because it is fun even if you're, you know, just trying out the new maps or weapons. But we should have, like, a huge content update, I'm hoping, pretty soon here. Let's do the 96. That is what you were suggesting earlier, or some of you. So let's do it. Dunk it, says Caesar. Didn't get to dunk it that time. But I'll try next time. Maybe Ink Brush after this, or the Luna Tri Slosher. Lots of suggestions. I gotta try to keep up with it. But I will uh, do my best. I'm in YouTube Gaming, says Young One Nicholas. I'm actually using YouTube Gaming to keep on top of the chat, because I think the chat is much bigger on YouTube Gaming. It's pretty much, I think you just put gaming dot, you know, before YouTube, and you can have the same link, I'm pretty sure. To watch the stream or there'll be something at the top of the chat that says watch this on YouTube gaming it just has a bigger chat and I don't know if there's many other advantages for you guys to watch it on there it's just more of a live streaming focus platform but it's basically the same I don't think there's that much to it but I am happy that they've improved the streaming a lot as an effect of YouTube gaming so you'll you'll see the effects even if you're watching this on YouTube it should be you know work better than it used to all right, Natalie says slam dunk it. I'll try to slam dunk it next time, but I don't know. I, the point of the Rainmaker is, uh, or the point of the the mode is to help that thing get slam dunked. I don't care who dunks it. It could be Jordan. It could be Muggsy Bogues. I don't know any of the current basketball players. <laughs> but yeah, any it could be Bugs Bunny. It could be the Monstars. I don't care as long as it gets dunked and we get that win. So I'll try to help out. I don't need to be the one that dunks it. Okay, we're going up against a Tri-Squad with a couple of uh, splash matics it looked like, and the good old E-Leader that I love. Let's throw this down here and try to, you know, just paint the turf, paint the line, and look out, because I know that E-Leader. At least there's less people to pay attention to here, so I don't have to worry as much about the others. But I will get sniped here if I'm not careful. Oh, did I get sniped? Yeah, they're way up there. They got a good beat on me, and it's also a Japanese player, so I gotta look out for getting sniped from behind a corner. <laughs> but yeah, it is just, if they have a, a line of sight on you and they can get you, then that's how it's gonna work. It's not gonna, it, it just, ha if you happen to move, it might look like you dodged it, but they got you. It just didn't update on your screen yet. Throw one of those down, and I gotta look out for the snipers here. Get that kid. Oh, I didn't have enough ink left because I threw my splash ball down. Oh, no, 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 no. Get this kid, maybe. Gotta look out. I got my splash ball, but it's not gonna help if I'm running out of ink here. Oh, jeez, my aim is horrible. There we go. Try to stop any of these guys getting through. Jump on them. Jump at them. And go. Alright. Can we jump? Man, some of this looks inkable, but it's not. <laughs> I heard that about this map before we even you know, got it, was that a lot of it looks inkable, 
and then it's uh, you gotta deal with it not being coverable, but it like confuses, like it seems like it would be. Oh jeez, I thought I had them. <laughs> they were going around the side. We got in our way there, stepping on my buddy's toes. Okay, don't let your guard down for just three people, says Killman. Yeah, definitely. You don't want to underestimate your tri squad, because they will beat you. And I have had that happen many a time. <laughs> if I can. Oh man, sniped again. That is a good spot for that little sniper, and they seem to just stay there for the most part until, yeah, someone messes with them and then they run away and go right back. <laughs> They're covering this whole thing. Okay, we got a slight lead on them, but not nothing too big. Oh, jeez. Gotta try to stay near my splash wall, or the sniper's gonna get me. I'm afraid of that little sniper. Okay, throw this down. Get up there and uh, take him out if I can. Oh, where'd they go? There they are. Oh, jeez. I think they got him. Okay, good, good, good. Took him out. Oh, this thing's in the way. This weird thing! Ah, ran out of ink again. I keep doing that. I'm running out of ink, I think, because I'm using my splash wall too much. Splash wall's still a good thing, but it's gonna use up all my ink, and then I got nothing for the kids out there that want to get splatted. All right, let me see if I can slow them down a little bit and not get sniped. Jeez. Oh, the glint that happens when someone is uh, sniping at you is kind of interesting. I'm gonna try to get close in here. No, they're around. Where did they go? Where did they go? Are they up there? I don't know. Oh, I just saw someone shooting over there. Maybe it was the, uh, maybe it was just, ah, <laughs> my imagination. Nope. Yeah, the 96 gal, I've noticed, I mentioned this earlier, between the 52 and the 96, because the 96 is slightly slower, it feels a lot tougher to, uh, to get the splat, even though it takes less shots. I almost prefer the, the 52. But they're both good. They can both be very effective. Ooh, jeez. Not a good spot here. Let's get rid of these. There we go. Let's stop these squid kids. Get the one. Oh my gosh. Ah. <laughs> okay. Got him. Get him. Got him. Good. Throw this down. And fight the way through. I gotta keep my ink up for when we run into kids here. Go, go, go. There they are. Stop them. Stop them! No! <laughs> they pushed me off! It wasn't even a splat. It was just a push into the water. All I needed was just a slight little tap. Are we gonna survive long enough for me to be able to jump in here? And do this? Here we go. Got the one. Can we do it? Can we get them? No! Jeez! These splash matic people, or yeah, the splash matics they're getting right up in my face. And I don't think I'm aiming fast enough to actually stop them. We've got a bit of distance on them, so we can win this. Just don't want to, you know. Oh, nope, we lost it. Get them. Oh, no. Oh, they're right there. Yeah, stop them. Oh, no, they got the distance in that last little bit. We have to take them out or we're going to be in trouble. Run, 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 run. I'll jump in. I'm jumping to you. Don't die. <laughs> I said that and then I got splatted. Ah, we lost it, and they beat us because of that little push right there. That's all it took. All right. The sniper was just destroying me. Let's switch weapons here. I do... I, it's weird. I think I, I was able to get into A rank with the 96 gal in the past, but at this point, I'm like, I don't know if it's helping me too much. It kind of depends on the map, too. I think I'd do better with this setup if I can just throw a splash wall and, like, stay back and defend something. Like, splash zones is where I use this weapon a lot, because you can just have that... Splash wall keeping people out of the zone. Unlike salt spray, there's a little doorway you can block, stuff like that. But for now, let's switch off of it. All right, so we're gonna make a new one here. I don't know if I, did we get King, King Pucky in here or whatever? <laughs> it's like Kentucky. Uh, I think they were making their own private match before, so hopefully they'll join one of these. I don't remember seeing them at all in here. All right, well, I wanna use something to get redeem ourselves from that last battle, so maybe I will uh, compare and contrast. Let's let's do the 52 gal and just see how we do with that. And then we'll we'll do maybe the Inkbrush Nouveau. That could do well in this mode. We got a few Hydras though. Maybe, okay, good, David switched off. I was gonna say more than one Hydra is kinda asking for disaster. 
but the hydras are good. I just I wonder if more than one is like you're not gonna be able to react fast enough to whatever people are doing. Yeah, I think if we ever had like an official bloop troop like f starting lineup, I would want to make sure we found a good one of you guys that can destroy with the the chargers because <laughs> it seems like every every time we lose, every good team we go up against uh, or team that's you know able to just pull out victory, they always have a really good charger player. It seems like it's essential to have range because then they're they're you know covering a lot of the map that you might not see and uh, be able to keep pressure on when it counts. Okay, who are we going up against? We'll see. Nigel has been, uh, says use the new squiffer, because uh, a lot of people want chargers, it's easier to aim. I kind of like the bamboozler, even though the new squiffer is, or the normal squiffer is probably a little bit safer. Oh no! Okay, hopefully we can do well. Probably the highest ranked team we've had all night here. Okay. We're going back to the museum. This is a good, you know, trial by fire. I'm learning the museum map, but at the same time, I feel like I'm not great at it. Okay, we got two splatlings. They got one as well, and an e-leader. Oh, uh, they got damage up, so you know they're one of those e-leader players that's going to use their burst bombs and try to go for quick, quick uh, scoping and stuff. Are we using? Yep, that's the one. All right, let me distract them with that. And hopefully, no one, no one uh, splats me here. Trying to throw that down to good spots, but... Oh no, they're shooting at me. Oh, jeez. I was like, I'm gonna go for the, the one guy down there, but we got Beret Girl jumping up and down. Looking cute, though. Hopefully they don't just blitz in and take us. Okay, good, good, good. Let's see if we can slow this here. Oh no. Slow it down! Ah. <laughs> even the Even with stuff to slow the Kraken down, it's like it can, it can slip through. I feel like the Kraken is in a good place, though. They've nerfed it so many times. I would want, I would be very sad if they nerfed it again. But uh, okay, that's us. That is us here going through. Don't want to jump in too fast. Oh no! I slowed them down enough to uh, do much. There's a sniper waiting for us. They're gonna get me though. I'm not careful. Stop them right here, possibly. Nope. They're not even messing with me. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> I keep worrying about the sniper, because I got sniped so many times last time, but it's like everyone else that's getting me. The Deco. That's a good one. I forgot the Deco that came out not that long ago, and it has the Quacken. A very useful Quacken. Alright. Oh, where are they? Oh, they're up there. There we go. Someone got him. Someone else is going around this way, though, I'm sure. Oh, jeez. Blow that up. Look out. Oh, anyone over that way? Maybe... Nope. <laughs> They're smart enough to get out of the way. Jeez. Having a tough time finding these guys to actually get them. Oh. Yeah, they're very quick to, like, get around, snipe, attack, take us up down before we can do that much. Don't want to jump right into there. That's a death sentence. But I need to push in, or I'm never going to be able to hit anyone. So I need to be sniping. Or I need to, you know, not just be sniping. I need to get close to take people down. Here we go. Throw one of these down. Maybe that'll slow them a little bit. Here we go. All right. I'm running in. I'm going through. Go, go, go. Stop anyone? Uh, <laughs> nope. <laughs> well, I pushed it a bit. I got some distance, right? <laughs> it's right on the edge. But yeah, we can, we can maybe get it over there. It's just, yeah. I thought we had it closer. Look at that distance. That's like barely anywhere close to it. Okay, don't jump down there for sure. Where is that sniper coming from? Are they in our area? No. They're just sniping from all the way over there <laughs> and hitting us still. Get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, jeez. Here they come. Here they come. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Got the one at least. <laughs> yeah, the Luna Blaster. I feel like I've got a weird got a weird like fear of it because it's so powerful but if I just kind of stay spaced good so that it can't you know do do well enough spacing where it can't really reach me that that you know easily then stop it in its tracks someone's gonna go around one of these ways I just know it all right throw that out there stop it man we keep getting it and losing it oh that's them <laughs> That's not us. They're all over the place here. I'm gonna get taken out if I'm not careful. 
Slow them down. Slow them down. <laughs> yeah, even with the 52, I feel like I'm not cutting, cutting it. But I keep, I gotta remember that I, uh, that we're going up against an S rank team here. Sometimes I forget. I'm like, oh, I'm not doing well with this weapon. Well, maybe it's just because the competition is so fierce. Stop this guy. And the burst bombs, they really give me trouble. The burst bombs on those snipers, they just seem like they're so good with them. Alright, throw this right in their way. Hopefully I'll stop someone here. There's someone right there. Ah! Their splash wall got me. Go, go, go! Don't let them get you! You could do it! Nope. <laughs> Man, I feel like the distance should be closer, but I guess we're still really far away. We're like... We're kind of close. We went around. We're going the long way. That's not a good, good idea. All right. Oh, we're tracking them. We're tracking them. Now I can kind of see where they are. I took one out. <laughs> That's the most I can hope for, I think, at this point with this S rank team. Take one out with you, and maybe that'll uh, that'll help a little bit. Well, they might not knock us out. Again. That's a, that's a point of pride, if that we can stop them from knocking us out. They're just going to stall, because that's the type of team they are. They don't even want to try to push. No, I, it is a little, I think that's why they're S rank. They know how to play and they know how to win. But it's a little, like, to just kind of take it and stall seems like a cheap tactic, because they're more afraid that someone's going to grab it in overtime. Whatever wins. But I think I uh, I lost a little bit of my Im Im being impressed by them when to have them just kind of stall out in a corner to finish. We wouldn't have pushed it. <laughs> they were afraid, though. There is that one chance, and that's why they're S-rank, and most of us aren't. Okay, let's try hopefully getting a team that's a little bit more our skill set, or my at least my skill set. We have some S-ranks in here, but I want to find a good, you know, good team that's a little bit lower ranked. <laughs> Preferably A or B. Even B would be fine, even though it's lower. Okay, so what are we going to do? I want to use the ink brush, but at the same time I feel like I'm not going to do well with it. Let's do that, you know, let's do the ink brush. I'll do one with the ink brush and we'll change equipment actually to get my good helmet to help me with some damage. All right, there we go. We got Mooney in here, David Grunky. Everyone's ready to go. Young one Nicholas says, everyone's hacking to make you lose. No, I don't think so. I don't mean to complain or anything, but yeah, it's very tough against some of these teams that are so good. Trying our best though. That's what matters. All right. Support our bloops. Thank you for supporting supporting our bloops in the chat and hanging out with us. If you want to leave a like, I appreciate it. We'll be doing much more Splatoon in the future here. And uh, maybe we'll, we'll do a handful more matches and then we'll finish up. We, I already did do a an hour-long Animal Crossing stream earlier, so if you did miss that and you want more, more content for tonight, check that out, please. Okay, we're trying the ink brush. I really need to... Uh, really need to get my tap speed up. Going back to the museum, I kind of was hoping we'd go to Camp Triggerfish, but I need the practice on here. All right, guys, got a big charger to worry about. Throw one of these in. Try to get my ink up a little bit so that I can kind of zip through and help help get the way to the uh, to the center here. Oh, let's get this going. There we go. Ooh, jeez. Look out, There's someone going around. Get him, 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 get him. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> I was tapping like crazy. I thought I had him. But they're like, you got to get right up in their face to get them with this brush. That's the tough part with this thing. All right, go, 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 go. Throw one of these down there. Get that going. Get them out of my way. And look out for snipers. It's a very important thing on this map and any. Is to not get sniped. And be very careful. Oh, there's a brush! Whoa! Oh, they're using the Nouveau. They're smart. They've got the bubbler. And they're also ninja squidding. It's weird to see a mostly s rank team and someone's actually using the brush. You wouldn't think that would happen too often. They're probably judging me for uh, for not using the brush. All right, let's be careful now. They're around here somewhere. I just saw them. Where did they go? Get this guy. Get him, get him, get him. Nope. Zip away! And, uh, Ink Strike, where? I don't even know where that is. I haven't learned this map that well. <laughs> get this little guy. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, jeez. <laughs> get that sprinkler that's not an enemy, but get it. Get him, get him, get him, get him. <laughs> Man, yeah, the range and the brush. I keep forgetting. It's so, so slow, or, uh, so low that it is very tough to, uh, 
to really do much. I hate when they throw the, the killer whale at spawn because it's, it's like we're just kind of sitting there, not able to do too much, but that's how she goes. All right, I'm trying to go over here. Who has, where is the Rainmaker? All right, we could take it this way. They're gonna snipe me if I'm not careful though. Throw one of those in, try to get more ink. I need to get into the fray. Can't just stay back forever and expect to uh, have the team, you know, triumph. No! <laughs> Shouldn't have stood there. I was trying to hide from this guy. Hide from the guy that was shooting at me. And then it really backfired because I uh, just got pushed right into the water again. It's happened a few times now. All right. I got the Rainmaker. Where are they? Where are they? Let me see if I can hide long enough to uh, do that. Look out. They're coming through here. Put that on there, and then it'll spin around and get him, hopefully. All right. Ooh, Inksuka. This, uh, the, the sprinkler is not going to stay alive all that long if I'm, you know, using it. Or, and die, you know, getting splatted before I can do much with it. Oh, got the one, but the ink brush took me out. But yeah, putting the sprinkler in a good spot if you can stay alive for a while is really helpful. But at the same time, it's like, don't worry too much about your sprinkler, because it will get destroyed when you die, and uh, you'll have to wait, you know, to get it to a good spot again. That's a pretty good spot, right? All right, what are you tracking? That's our sniper. Let's see if I can kind of get around here. I know that ink brush is like waiting to find a good spot. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, jeez. Throw that down. As long as they don't see me, that'll help. They're probably gonna find me though, if I'm not careful. We gotta get close. We gotta get close here. I wanna get these guys. Oh, where are they? Where are they coming from? <laughs> Jeez. I just flailed around me like, get them, get them, get them. Wherever they're coming from. Oh no, this is a good time. This is a good time to push. Our Rainmaker's all alone though. Oh no, Mooney. He's doing a great job. But uh, it didn't work out. <laughs> Jeez. As soon as I get in there, splatted. Yeah. The ink brush, I do like the Octobrush brush a little better just because I feel like it's actually giving me more damage for the uh, for the time I put into it, you know, the amount of clicking and firing. But at the same time, the ink brush is a bit faster. It's just tougher to use. Get this kid. Get this squid kid. There they go. They're hiding from me. I just saw them around here. Nope. Get him, get him, get him. They're going to gang up on me. Ah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> They always gang up on me. I was having a nice duel with brushes, but then I got cornered. Okay, go back in. Could take that one path again. Oh no, only 20 seconds. I don't think we're gonna make it, especially if I jump like that. No, no, no. Not good. Running out of time. Someone's jumping to me. I gotta get in there. Gotta get in there and try to ink strike. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> Will I get anyone? Nope. All right, yeah, they did the same tactic again. The the tactic of champions, grab it and run away to your turf so no one can take it. <laughs> All right, so what are we using next? The ink brush did not work out, but that was a tough team. We did our best. Let's see, yeah. Maybe we should go back to the Hydra a little bit. I know there's a lot of a lot of weapons out there, but I'd like to see how I do with the Hydra again. We are never we're, haven't gotten knocked out in a while, which is nice. <laughs> But at the same time, we really need to uh, really need to get some wins here. All right, let's see if we can uh, switch it up. I want to make sure that we get some fresh people in here as well. Here we go. Lots of recommendations. If you guys want to see the Hydra again, I would like to do that. But I want to make sure I'm switching it up as well. All right, let's do this. Do do do. Trying to keep up with all the stuff going on, all the suggestions and comments and stuff. Okay, let's switch it. Bamboozler. The bamboozler might be like the worst idea in this ranked mode. I would just get destroyed. Splashomatic. I haven't really used the Splashomatic much, but at the same time, I uh, there was that other team did really well with it. You can see if a weapon is really far back on my list, then I haven't used it in a while. <laughs> like the Splashomatic there. The one splash matic this one's pretty good. It's got all the suction bombs. Let's do the splash matic I see a few people saying that. All right, do that. Because I think this bomb rush is really good. 
If we can do suction bomb rush, that'll at least help out way more than the seeker bomb rush. We got multiple. <laughs> we got a lot of people that love to use the uh, the splatlings tonight for sure. Showing off the other splatlings as well as the hydra. Okay, here we go. We're determined. We gotta get a win. Well, maybe we'll finish up the next time we get a win. We'll go until we win one more. I don't wanna. That might be a trap to. <laughs> And, and we'll never win again. No, we could win. We could win this next one. This could be it. This could be our game. We got a nice balanced team. Let's do it. Hopefully you guys are rooting for us. Remember to support, support your bloops. All right, let's do it. We got Camp Triggerfish, so I'm happy to mix that up. Thank you guys once more for hanging out and helping me out in the uh, the old squad. All right, for that. <laughs> I, I, I know I'm kind of like using my ink really fast, but I always feel like if you're going to be traveling, I mentioned that before, just kind of, you know, throw throw your uh, throw your best foot forward and uh, try to get these guys. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> try to uh, try to get a bit of ink built up for your special by just throwing a bomb somewhere right when you right when you start, because then it'll get you a little bit more turf covered. There we go. Throw one there. Who's going? Who's Who's it? Uh, moving around here. Make sure that I'm covering a lot of this. Nope. Ah, oh, jeez. Yeah, the splash wall, I felt like no one used it for a while there. I don't think people really knew the, the true power of it, but it's it's caught on, and it was even nerfed not that long ago. So, splash wall is now a known thing that is uh, really good. <laughs> oh, almost got him there. Trying to keep my suction bombs going. And, uh... Putting out good pressure here. All right, there we go. Suction bomb rush. Nope, not gonna work. <laughs> Didn't get anyone. I got snuck up on, but at least my team's going around. This would be a kind of a sad victory, though, if we get it. It is a good, you know, any victory is good, but I would be a little sad to uh, have this be the last win because I'm not contributing very much. I got ink stri <laughs> or ink right when I jumped in. I thought I'd be okay. Maybe not. Someone's been sneaking around our base. Who took the cookies from our cookie jar? I'm gonna try to put a little security here and uh, make sure whoever's going around is not still over here. All right, and they're going over this way. They're gonna be coming through here. Building up my special, though. I don't, if I get to use it, that'll be nice, but we'll see. Okay, they're coming through. This is what I wanted to do here. Oh, jeez. Look out. Throw these bombs all over the place. <laughs> I almost ran out of uh, of ink there to do that. Alright, here we go. Put that in. Look out. Get him, get him, get him. Ah, oh, jeez. Get him, jeez. No! Okay, good. <laughs> they were just jumping all over the place and I could not get anyone there. Alright, don't let them sneak up on me. That's my goal for this one. Lost the Rainmaker. Okay, oh, no! <laughs> I had it. And then Inkzuka, once again, the Inkzuka is still very power, you know, popular. I thought it wouldn't be as popular anymore after, after the several nerfs. I think it got at least one big nerf where it's, uh, oh yeah, it's really slow now compared to how it used to be, and it also costs more points to actually use it. That was something they changed because uh, didn't cost as many points before in the past to uh, to use the old Inkzuka. Right, let's see if I can throw bomb in there and stop these guys. Oh, who got me? I got the one. Oh, it was just both of us hit each other. <laughs> All right. We've got the lead. I think we'll be okay, but they didn't, they haven't gotten it past the middle, so they're not really leading. But remember before, I was like, okay, we got the lead. We'll be all right. No. Ah, I thought it would be okay. But yeah, trying to, trying to bank on having the lead is not a good idea in any ranked mode, because you're just going to have people, uh, you know, take you out and run away. If I can stop this. Stop this thing from getting us. Do they know I'm here? Maybe not. I'm gonna help out. Look out! <laughs> Slosher got us, but we took him out with the, <laughs> with the Rainmaker shield. But yeah, if, if you kind of bank on the fact that your team is doing well, obviously it's, uh, it can really backfire on you. So be careful with that. Alright. Close in. Slow these kids down. Get them. There we go. Yeah, this thing takes quite a few shots to uh, to splat. But at the same time, I do like how fast it is. Anyone going around this way? Let's see. 
one of those up there. If they are. They're trying to track me. Oh, got that behind their shield. I don't know if that's gonna get them in the end. Alright. Suction bomb rush. Take them down if they are ready to be blown up. No! Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is close. They're all up in us. And uh, right in our faces. Stop that slosh. Where is their, their Rainmaker? Oh no. Can we do it? Yeah, use that. Slosher. Or not slosher. Uh, splatling. <laughs> so hard to think in the middle of battle. But we can do this. We can do it. We got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Fight, everyone fight. Running out of ink. Oh, nope. <laughs> oh no, this is bad. Okay, we're good. I was going to say, we all fought. <laughs> I think we got that one. Maybe one more match. All right. Thank you guys again. I don't want to finish on a good note. No, I do want to finish on a good note. <laughs> but I think I kind of want to finish with the Hydra. Because I've been uh, I've been using it a bit. I like it. I think it would be good to win with the Hydra and finish that way. Or maybe the Octobrush. Okay, let me know real quick before we get into this last match. Octobrush or Hydra Splatling. And we'll finish with that. I want to go with what you guys want to see more. All right. Thank you again. I think um, uh, we're doing okay, but I might be losing losing the power to ink effectively after two streams. So thank you for sticking with us. All right. Determined to win, says Gunther Penguin. We were, or Gunther, however you want to say that. Okay, so Octobrush or Hydra Splatling? Which one? Very different, and it's magic when they change hands like that. All right. Let's see. You got Splatoon, says <laughs> Darlene. I've been Splatooned for months now. It's a very serious condition. Okay, let me see. What are we going to use? Cheers from Columbia, says Nature Asian Draw. Thank you. Awesome. I love seeing, you know, where everyone's from. Hydra. Lots of Hydra. Okay, Octobrush. I think the Hydra's going to win this, but I see a few Octos. Let's do the Hydra. The Hydra's newer. I kind of said the Octo because I like to use it, and it's also in the thumbnail. <laughs> But, you know, I put Hydra Splatling in the title, so you guys will know if you're watching. You're going to get both. All right. Thanks again. Last match here. We got Mooney. We got David. We got Grunky. The, pretty much the main squad for most of the night. And we're going to finish up with one last Rainmaker match. Let's see if I can do well with the Hydra one last time before I hang it up for the night. All right. Let's see. Uh... Oh, when's episode... Annika's asking about Triforce Heroes. I gotta find a good time to record with Danielle still to get more of those, you know, Yoshi's Woolly World and Triforce Heroes out. But I will have that soon. I've been working on, uh... If you're watching this live, this is like a news update for what's happening with the channel. But I've been working on Minecraft snapshot stuff, getting uh, getting caught up with all the, the updates with that, with 1.9. So I haven't had too much time to do other videos. But I will get back to those series. That's why I've been streaming a lot more, because it's easier to just kind of do a stream and have that be the video for the day. All right, going up against that minty spearmint toothpaste. This is an S squad, so we're going to have a rough time here. But I will try my best. Throw one of those in. I think I need to get up on here, but also be careful, because uh, if I'm not, then uh, ooh, I can probably help this. I can help this. I can do it. Yeah, there we go. Do they have any long-range stuff? Because if they don't, I think I can, I can hit them most of the way here. I'm back in this spot. Just got to charge up. Let me see if I can help. Go, go, go. The power of the Hydra is not going to work this time. Go, go, go. Try to stop these guys. Oh, jeez. Got one of them. Got one, at least. Throw that down there. Almost. There we go. Got another. They're going around the other way, though, so... I'm not going to be able to do as much if I don't get over there. Okay, go, 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 go. Echo locator. That's going to help a little bit. Throw one of those down. And go, go, go. Okay, they lost it. Let's see if I can block the spot here. They see me. Get that sprinkler out of here. They're just trying to distract me with it. All right. Try, trying to make sure no one gets through. There we go. That helped. And the sprinklers, did, or the, uh, the seekers didn't do so hot there, so... Fight the power! Get it, get it, get it! Oh, jeez. Don't sneak up on me. No one sneak up on me. <laughs> I'm so paranoid that someone's gonna sneak up. Oh, they went the other way. I should have watched it. I thought we had the Rainmaker there, so I was like, I'll just burst the shield and let my buddies take it. 
watch the other way, but it did not work out how I planned. Get him, get him, get him! Oh my gosh, I stopped him with that bomb at the last second. Go, go, go! Let's see if I can get through here. Nope! Oh no! <laughs> it's a seeker. Okay, we're going this way. We're going this way! Hopefully someone will uh, help me here. Get through. Okay, good job. David, help me out. We're going, we're going. Nope! Oh no, no, no. Charge this up and let her rip! <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying. Okay, they're protecting. They're protecting! Lead the way, lead the way. This isn't a good way to go, but that's okay. Jump up, jump up, and get down. Here comes a crazy. <laughs> they're they're hiding that way, but I'm. Oh no no no! Where are they? Ah oh, no! Oh, they were that. Oh, I couldn't tell where they were from. I was like the the carbon roller was there, and they didn't go after me. We were so close. My team kind of split off. I was hoping they would follow me onto the the rafter thing. All right. Ah oh, no no no! Didn't mean to fall. Put that going. Okay. We can jump up this, right? We're good, we're good. Wait. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Alright, I got this charged. Anyone in my way will have to answer to the uh, Hydra. Get him, get him, get him. They're going that way. Alright, this time I need to be extra careful that no one is following me. Stop him, stop him, stop him! Rock him, stop him, robots! Alright, someone's gonna be going this way. If I'm not careful. There we go! I can't jump up and get that, but someone else will. Alright, guys. This way. Throw a bomb in. Ah! Get him! Jeez. I shouldn't have ran in so fast. Okay, we got time. We can do this. They had it so close. But I think we can we can catch up. Just gotta get him. So much, so much carnage. Is it worth it in the end? One of these down. Look out! There we go. Got him. I gotta, I gotta wield this. This is my burden. Oh, go, go, go! Try to get over there and over this wall. Oh no, no, no! Okay, go, go, go! Someone help me! <laughs> oh, get that guy out of the way! No! <laughs> oh, this is so intense. I'm, uh, I'm trying to wield the rainmaker best I can, but making it very tough on us. Oh, we lost it already. Jeez. We're, we're doing so well at times, but at the same time, it's uh, very tough to keep it going unless our whole team is, like, on point and together because they will just break us up and divide us and conquer. All right. Look out for these Seekers. This is a pretty good level for Seekers. Seems like, at least. Uh, don't want to get too close. Trying to look out. Okay, good good crackening there. <laughs> good crackening, my friend. Try to make sure no one is able to uh, go. Throw that in. Look out! Nah. <laughs> Man, I'm trying my best to get in there, but the Hydra is not doing me any favors with that slow charge. Okay, where is it? Where is it? They're pushing in. They're pushing in. We only have a few seconds here to uh, finish them off. We're gonna, and hopefully... Hold on to that. Nope. They held it. We need to do one more, I think. That was not a good fit. Like, that was a good a good fight, and hopefully an entertaining match, but I want to get one more win. That was good. That was back and forth. I had it pretty far, and I kept getting taken out a couple times that I took it. Good job, team, though. We fought back against all S ranks, and we gave them a run for their money. All right. So one more, guys. <laughs> I don't want to make this stream go too long, but you can tell I'm into playing a game if I'm just like, yeah, I'm a little tired, but I gotta, I gotta go out on a win. Thank you guys again. I'm gonna stick with this team and stick with the Hydra and see if we can do it, because I feel like we are very, very close to a victory. If only we get a, you know, better ranked team. Even with an S ranked team, I think we can do it. I'm confident in our skills. All right. Thank you guys again. Do you ever play Triforce Heroes on your own, says Cecil? Not really. A lot of games I don't really play on my own. <laughs> I only play when I record because I don't really have time otherwise to play. There are a few games that I've played to test out to see if it would, you know, would be good for the channel. I've been playing a bit of Yokai Watch because I want to record that. But some games like Metal Gear Solid 5, I, I play that on my own, or I was for a while, but I didn't record that. Stuff like that. All right. Uh, let's see. We've got. Some more Octobrush suggestions. Maybe if we don't win this one, I can switch to the Octobrush. Oh no, more S+. Okay, 
Let's see. I feel like I'm doing better with the Hydra than the, uh, the Octo Brush, for now at least, but Mooney's also using the Hydra. We'll see. This is a very tough, uh, this is a tough match, or tough, tough map to get the, the Rainmaker to the goal. I've noticed a lot of the other teams don't get a knockout on this map even, and uh, some of them are, are really good, like S-ranked teams. We'll probably get, you know, knocked out really easily now that I said that, but we'll do our best not to. Okay, I'm going to get up to a good spot. I didn't see if they were actually, uh, had any snipers, though. Alright, took that one out. Try to take this little guy down, wherever they are. Nope, not going to wake if they, uh, don't let me here. Oh, they do have a sniper. See if I can kind of push through, slow him down, and take him out. Almost. No, no, no. Oh, it's a Kraken. Kraken, Kraken. Nope. Jump. Uh, <laughs> I was like, maybe it won't notice me. When there's no ink around, the Turf Wars, it seems like it's easier to get rid of, or get away from the Kraken. Yep, they slammed it <laughs> right after I said that. Uh, turf Wars, it seems easier to get away from the Kraken because there's like complete curf turf coverage most of the time. But in ranked, most people don't bother to cover most of it because that's not the goal. So then you get stuck. Swimming to nowhere. I really feel like three three splatlings is probably not a great strategy. <laughs> uh, maybe we'll try one with the Octo Brush because I, I said I was, you know, we, we still were doing well with the Hydra, but I want to get a win to finish. So maybe the Octo Brush is, is what we need to finish this up. Let me grab my helmet so that I'm ready. And there we go. Okay, Octo Brush to finish. We got it both ways. And maybe I should just see if anyone else wants to jump in if they have a spot. There we go. And good. All right. This <laughs> is hashtag poop troop. We're not doing too good, Grumpy, Ca Grumpy Cat in the chat said that. But I don't know if we qualify as the poop troop yet. But doing our best. <laughs> it still sounds endearing, even if... Okay. Let's see. We got to uh, gotta get our team in here, and we'll be good to go. I keep going back and forth. I think we're a lower rank than when we started, but we did get a lot of experience, and we're level 36. Plus, we're getting tons of monies. Oh, we got Joseph. Okay, so at least one fresh player in here. Joseph's going to try his luck. And Re uh, Rekart Conradi says, Will you ever play with Danielle, play Splatoon with Danielle? I mentioned this before, but i got to get Danielle up on how to actually play so that we have... You know, she's got a fight in chance if we play the Battle Dojo. So I'll try to do that sometime here. I forgot to mention that to her tonight. So, like, we got to try to do that. But I don't want it to just be very lopsided. But, you know, if you've seen other times when Daniel's played multiplayer with me, like Pikmin 3, some of the other games, uh, Mario Party, she's no slouch, even if she doesn't really know how to play the game. A lot of the time she pulls through. <laughs> okay. Let's see. There we go. Everyone's ready. Got Days of... Days... I, I combined David and Joseph. There's a new name, Dasif. Kind of sounds like it would be in a S Star Wars movie or something. All right. Oh, no. Hashtag poop troop <laughs> has started. It's making the rounds. Uh, chaos, or Chow Cupcakes, I think, is, uh, unless it's chaos, but it looks like Chow. Uh, when more amiibo tings, they said. Uh, amiibo, I want to get back to the uh, getting the amiibo missions done, but... I'm, uh, ha I'm having fun streaming with you guys, so I haven't really thought about that too much recently. They used a little emoji thing that looks like a pig nose, but it reminds me of the pig masks. Like the pig mask army in Mother 3. That's maybe maybe YouTube's catering to niche games. Who knows? Alright, I remember when I was just thinking about the uh, Chows from Sonic or Chaos. Like, they're spelled very similarly. But as a kid, I used to call the Chaos Emeralds the Chachos Emeralds, because I had no idea how to say Chaos. That was one of those things, I might have mentioned that before, but I definitely mentioned during a, a Pokemon video before that w as a kid, it was like very easy to uh, get it locked in your mind how to pronounce certain things, and then uh, have to deal with... Sorry guys, I bailed. Have to deal with the ill, uh, the Ill effects of remembering, you know, everything as... Oh, jeez. But remembering a word that is not said that way and, like, keeping that ingrained in your mind where you just always think it's going to be, you know, said a different way. And with Pokemon, I, for a while, I thought you said uh, Govanov instead of Giovanni. So I just didn't know. I was just a kid. I didn't know. Oop, they disrupted him. And we're getting ink-striked. Oh, no. This is when they're going to try to jump through. Someone going to sneak around and try to get me. Oh, Kraken time. 
Get them both if I can. I got one. Oh, no, the other one escaped. They're gonna try to get me as soon as I finish. Yep, I should have ran away. I took out the Rainmaker, though. That's what matters. Look at all that defense up. I've never seen that much, really, on an enemy squid kid. All right. I'm jumping in, and... No, no, no. Let's see if I can stop whoever's jumping through. Nope, they got it. Ah, they got a blaster, and they got the disruptor on it. So I was just messed up there. Could not do anything. All right, they're trying to go around. Gotta keep my gamepad level so I can actually... Ah! <laughs> actually do something. I was not expecting someone down there. This is probably going to be a defeat, but we're trying our best against these s rank teams. Nothing much you can do past that. Where did they go? Oh, jeez. Oh, they, st they saved their special because they're very coordinated, and they're probably talking to each other. They both used their killer whales to just kind of clear us out, but it didn't fully work. I think we might be able to uh, catch back up here quick enough. Try to get around. Okay, good. Stopped him. Stop him. I'm getting through, hopefully. All right. Oop, there's somebody coming through. If we can slow him down enough, we might be able to do this. Maybe I'll take the Rainmaker. If we can. Nope. Ah, oh, jeez. As soon as I grabbed it, they took me out with the Dynamo. All right. But yeah, this is another team that I'm like, unless they've practiced and told each other, okay, you shoot the Killer Whale, and then I'll shoot it the other way. That seems like a technique that it's like they're probably talking on some type of chat system. All right, they're waiting for us to blast it, and then they'll grab it probably as soon as uh, as soon as they can. Oh nope, let's back up here. And uh, nope, I went through on accident, and they're gonna snipe me. Oh, let me jump up and just you know give you a little how do you do there, my buddy. All right, someone grab that. <laughs> we need it. Are they echolocating us? Are we echolocating them? Question for the ages. Let me jump up here and stop whoever's going around. Nope. I thought I got him. Oh, jeez. Look out. <laughs> Gotta back up a little bit. No, no, no. Ah. <laughs> I think they stopped the Rainmaker. Their killer whale usage is, like, crazy good here. All right. Let me try to stop them if I can. We're going to do our best. That's all we can... What did we... Just, did we just get a, uh, get a, uh, killer whale? Oh, we, they've got it. All right, they knocked us out. I was trying to even remember what I was trying to say. I just got killer whaled without even seeing where it was, uh, where it was coming from there. All right. I got distracted because I was trying to keep up with the chat here, but did not work out. All right. If we could just get a not s rank team, I would love to finish that way. If not, we might just have to reside to uh, end on a defeat. What do you guys want to see? One more Octobrush, or I kind of want to go back to the Hydra. I don't want to disappoint anyone, but I'd like to <laughs> I'd like to finish on the Hydra, so maybe we'll do that. All right. Thank you guys again for tuning in. This will probably be the last match. I think I need to, I have to cut myself off and say, even if we lose, let's make this the last one and try to go out as best we can. Jarrett says, what's your favorite map and weapon? I think the Octobrush is my favorite weapon, but it's kind of tough. There's a lot of different really good weapons in the game that I enjoy using. Tentatech, Ink Brush, now the Hydra Splatling. My favorite map, I think of the old ones, probably Black Belly. Of the newer ones, I really like Camp Triggerfish that we were just playing on. All right. Cynthia says, Splatfest news, is there? I don't think they're actually, they didn't announce any. Maybe they're going to announce the Splatfest next weekend for Thanksgiving, and then it will be... Um, it will be on the, uh, the week after that, like, after Thanksgiving. They will just, uh, kind of not have it on the hol holidays for once. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, I think they keep timing them on the holidays, weirdly. So maybe they're trying not to do that this week. But yeah, the North American Splatfest hasn't been announced. Same with the, the European one. Unless you guys saw something I didn't see, but they don't usually announce it this late at night. I could check Twitter real quick just to see but yeah we probably have a little bit to wait for whatever reason they just haven't said what's going on with the uh with the splat fests and why they're they're delaying them but we'll find out here soon yeah i don't think any splat fest news has come out so we got to keep waiting oh here we go all right finally a team that's at our level and this should be the end hopefully uh we'll win if even if we don't then it'll be fine thank you guys again 
and we'll finish up with this one one last time into the camp. Or go. I wanted the green. That's my favorite. Well, not that. That color's good. It's like a nice lime. It's not my favorite of the inks, but it looks nice. All right, I'm going up here. We're both getting the same idea here, Mooney. Oh no, Mooney let me go up there, but then I got I fell off. I didn't really do it very well. All right, throw one of those in. Try to slow anyone down here that tries to get through. All right, I gotta get this all inked so I can kind of watch this side like so. There we go. Get this going. Make sure I watch anyone heading through. It's gonna have to deal with my inking. Go, go, go. Oh no, they got a bomb rush. Yeah, they're pushing way in. Anyone anyone pushing through there? Did they sneak around? They did, didn't they? Or no, that was just a that was just a bomb that happened to go through there. There we go. Oh my gosh. Did I get three of them? Two of them at least. Get them, get them, get them, get them, get them. I'll throw one of these in. Hopefully that'll do the job. I like when I can just kind of stay up here. This would be a very good weapon for splat zones, I feel like, because I could just kind of hang out up top and uh, chill while I take anyone out that gets through. There we go. All right, if they're going back through here, I might stay here for a little bit. The suction bomb takes a little longer to, uh, to fire there, so here we go. Yeah, anyone going around this way, I'm stopping them, but I'm not helping as much with the actual Rainmaker, so I gotta be careful with what I'm doing. All right, let's charge up, and I will uh, go around over here, kinda try to make sure Anyone going through has to deal with me. Come on. Oh, they're getting it. They're getting it. All right, let me try to block this way. Go, 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 go. Nope. Oh, duck it. Did I do it? I did it. <laughs> Jeez. There's someone right there, though. Stop them. Oh, no. <laughs> I took the one, but I couldn't get the other. Okay, good, good, good. Go, go, go. We're doing a good job. We almost have this. They're going to get us, though. That's okay. We can get it. We got a good lead on them. They barely got any. We can finish strong, I think, here, Bloop Troop. As long as we hold hold together and uh, try our best to uh, stop anyone heading through here. There's someone coming this way. I just saw them. No. Oh, my gosh. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Not good. All right, let me see if I can. Where are they? Where are they? Oh, no. I got Inkzuka. They're pushing way in. Oh no, we were doing so well. Okay. We can do this. We can do this. Good job, Bloop Troop. Fighting the good fight. Alright, I try my best here. Slow them down as much as I can if they're going around this way. Alright, good, good, good. Stop them. Stop them. <laughs> oh man. I'm having a tough time keeping this away from their clutches. Oh, jeez trying to make sure they're not going. It's very tough when you don't have much visibility and you're trying your best to uh, keep firing at everyone and protecting the whole area. No, no, no. I'm running out of ink. They're going to get us. They're going to get us. There we go. Stop them. Oh, there we go. Okay, good. Friends. <laughs> Countrymen. <laughs> Lend me your ink. All right. One of these down. Go, 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 go. All right. I'm covering you. I'm covering you, Mooney. Trying my best to get this going. They're gonna be jumping up here, aren't they? Someone might sneak around. Gotta watch out. Gotta watch out. They're going this. Okay, they're going this way. So I'm gonna cover this side. <laughs> Throw one of these down. All right, we're doing good. We're doing good. They're going across the bridge. Can't reach them there. No, we lost it. <laughs> This is a very close match here, but trying my best. Uh, <laughs> I think we can do this. We got a minute. We can dunk it. Go, Bloop Troop, go! Time to jump in, and hopefully we'll stop them in time. Otherwise, this might not be good. All right, they're going that way. Okay, we stopped them. We stopped them. <laughs> such a back and forth here. Such a, such a crazy match. I think we can get them. Got to get our ink up and keep blasting them. Go, go, go. Stop them, stop them, stop them. Okay, good, good, good. A little bit more and I'll get my echolocator. Oh, no. Don't shoot me. <laughs> All right. We could do this. We could do this. Man, this is going back and forth. It's carnage here. We both try to uh, claim 
The Rainmaker in the last few seconds. Here we go. Shoot him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got it. We got it. Just hold on to it a little longer. And we should be fine. All right. Good job. No knockout, but we got a win. Bloop Troop fought so much <laughs> to get that and earned it. Thank you guys for watching. If you want to leave a like, I appreciate it. That's going to be it for tonight. Thank you for staying up with me for Splatterday Night Live. Look at those Squid Kids dance. They're coordinated, and they love to hug those guns. All right. Beat a squad that was pretty dang good, and they're all almost level 50. All right. <laughs> See you guys next time for more Splatoon.